Paul and Silas bound in jail had no money for to go to bail. But keep your eyes on the prize. Hold on, hold on. Good morning. My name is Jackson, and my name is Michaela. We're here to interview Sister Viola Black. What was life like for you as a as a student? Well, uh, when I was like in elementary school. It was good, however, we, we weren't allowed to um, go to the white schools. So we had our own, we had a black school, what we called black schools back in the day. And um, it was good. We had all black teachers. We had only one room for school, can you imagine? And uh, in high school, we had to bus bus meaning we had to go away from home to go to high school. My last two years of high school was uh, 70 miles one way away from home. So the students had to travel 70 miles one way, which is 140 miles round trip to school every day, five days a week. And, the, and the, one of the students was the bus driver because we weren't allowed to go to the white schools. That was in our uh, community. What made you want to become a nurse? I've always wanted, since I was, when I was a kid, I always wanted to, I love taking care of people, and that's what drove me to be a nurse, because I was, I've always been a caregiver. In my mind, I was a caregiver. So, I, I made it that happen with the help of God. What was your scariest moment as a nurse? My scariest moment as a nurse was when I lost my first patient, my patient died. That was my scariest moment. How long have you been a nurse? I've been in the nursing profession for, it will be 56 years in August of this year. And, it, and all the years has been at Parkland Hospital. Thank you for taking the time to talk to us. You're welcome. Oh, oh, oh.